pants, shirts, jackets. After gowning up. Another day at the office. From head to toe. Surgery, stat. We met Dr. Kava Bagheri. Start this off with an elbow bump. There we go. <laughs> Scrubbed up and waiting in the OR. It sounds to me like you have a new toy. We sure do. Sharp Grossman is the first hospital in the county to land this half a million dollar device called the Monarch. We are very excited because now we are able to do things that we were not able to do previously. Lung cancer kills more people in the U.S. than any other type of cancer, and robotic-assisted bronchoscopy catches cancer at its earliest stages. So the patient is laying down here. Okay. The patient will be under general anesthesia and has a breathing tube going inside the lungs. Using a joystick. These are the two robotic arms. Dr. Bagheri guides the robot to twist and turn a scope down into the tiny airways of the lungs. The computer will give us the road map in our bronchoscope. We will follow this path until we reach the nodule that we would like to biopsy. Using a patient's CAT scan, the Monarch works just like a GPS to guide you directly where you need to go. This isn't my first robotic procedure. <laughs> Three years ago at Sharp Coronado, I operated with the Da Vinci robot. That is Unbelievable. Extracting a piece of licorice. I see the offender. From a Channel 8 pinata. That's disgusting. That definitely needs to come out. It was as easy as taking candy from a baby. Here it comes. <laughs> and now with the Monarch, patients can get answers in 30 minutes or less. I have no doubt that over time, this will become the standard of care. And I have no doubt that every hospital in town will have this. So breathe easy, San Diego. It feels good. <laughs> Your lungs have a new lifesaver. You feel like a champ. <laughs> in the Zevely Zone, Jeff Zevely, News 8.